Welcome back, everyone. Another day on Mind Test. I did not sleep last night. I decided that my time would be better used if I started to do some mining. Oh, okay, I got it. So, I built a mine. Another one? But before I started mining, I did some research. Um, in the games that I played before, I found that my mining technique was poor and seemed to take forever to get down. I was just basically building a staircase down as deep as I could go. And after looking at the mine test wiki, because I was really unsure at what depth these specific ores um, actually generated in the map, I found, you know, coal you can pretty much find anywhere, but copper and tin start at a depth of um, 64, basically below sea level. Iron starts at 128, gold 256, Mesa at 512, and diamond at 1024. So that's quite a ways down. And, you know, I didn't want to do the staircase method to get down there. So, just to show you quickly. Oh, it's not in there. It's actually in my inventory. I got down to below the 128 level and found some steel. I also have copper and tin. So maybe I'll show you the mine real quick. The method that I decided to use was just basically building um, ladders and mining straight down. Uh, it seemed to work pretty good. I could put out three ladders at a time as I went down. And when you're standing on the ladder, you don't have to worry about falling. So if we came across a big cave or, you know, who knows if lava generates at that height. But this is it. <clears throat> so I just basically mined straight down, putting out three ladders at a time. Like I would, I would stand on the bottom rung, mine down three blocks, put down three ladders, and just continued all the way down. Now my first little shaft, which is right here, was where I first found the copper and the tin. And we're at a depth of 73 at this point here. If we keep going down, we'll go to the iron shaft. It's at a depth of 134. And at this depth, you can only find small clusters of iron. Um, you have to go down to a depth of 256 until you start uh, running across the large clusters of iron. So this is it. As far down as I got, I did find some more copper and some iron just down through this shaft. So this is going to be my main uh, mining shaft through here. Three wide, three high. Gives us a lot of room. And then branching off of this main run, um, probably like here, so I can move these torches after, but we're just going to have single block shafts running through here, and we're going to strip mine this layer, get as much, as, uh, as much iron as we can at this level, and then we'll continue the shaft down. <coughs> um... I don't know if we're going to go all the way to gold at the 256 layer, but we might. We might end up doing another iron shaft, you know, kind of at the midpoint and then gold and, you know, eventually we'll get ourselves down to diamond, but 1,024 blocks is a long way down. So we won't do any more mining right now. I just wanted to show you guys what I did last night, um, running on basically no sleep for what, four or five days here now. I'm going to have to sleep tonight. I don't really have to, but I should. So now that we have our um, steel ingots, we can build a bucket. 
and we can get our crops growing around the house. I'm going to start a little garden and not really have to worry about food so much. So, there we are. And I'm going to have to redo this entrance a little bit because right now it's pretty ugly. But that is for a later date. So we'll go make our steel bucket. Definitely gonna have to do some more work around the house. I don't know if that's gonna happen today or not. Um, those posts over there are looking terrible. I think I put my pine back in the chest up here, so I'm gonna make enough for some pine fence. Probably enough. I don't want to take too many right now because my pine is limited. Don't really need any armor at the moment. Okay, so we have four. Because this is bothering me right here. Okay, so now we need to decide where we're going to have our garden. After, of course, we make our steel bucket. Go grab some water. And, and we'll take it over here. After playing my creative map, and coming back to this survival map, my house just looks terrible and it's driving me crazy. So I might end up sprucing it up a little bit um, outside of, you know, recording the gameplay. Just so I don't have to put you guys through that and I don't have to deal with looking at this horrendous house for too much longer. There's a cow. Hello cow. So our pasture area will probably end up being in this nice big flat spot, so in terms of our garden, maybe we can just start a little patch right here, kind of underneath the trees, and that won't be too bad of a spot. So. Throw down some water. Do I have a hoe? I don't think I've made a hoe yet. Let's do that. Let's make a cobblestone hoe. A stone hoe. Um, I'm gonna plant that corn and maybe some cucumber. Can I just plant them like this? Oh, I can. Okay, perfect. And some more cucumber because we have it on hand. So there is the start of our garden. Beautiful. <clears throat> Grab a bit more water. We'll extend that garden a little bit. Probably out to here. Oh. Oh, I cannot smash these blocks today. Not sure if I have any other plants. Oh, we can get some onions in there. Okay, and that'll provide us with some food for a little while longer. It's not much of a garden, but we have a start, which is great. Um, whoop. Yeah, I can get those, actually. Um, okay. So this is for a bit more water. And I might as well fill them up now and just get it done with. Do the 
this three more times just to get those little troughs filled up. One more. Perfect. Okay. Looks like our pine trees are growing. That's always nice. Because we're going to need that to um, continue building our fence, I believe is what we can build with the uh, oak and uh, the other wood sources that come in the more trees mod. I am also going to have to start digging up some of this grass and find some wheat or wheat seeds anyways that we can plant because I'm going to need that in order to tame some the sheep and the cattle. I believe you tame the cattle with wheat as well. I haven't really looked out here before yet, but we won't go out there today. So yeah, I'm going to leave the video here. I'll spend the night sleeping tonight. Then I might wake up in the morning. Um, probably not going to record tomorrow. I think I'm just going to do some work. I'll work on the house a little bit and I will try and find some wheat seeds that I can plant, get our garden going a little bit more, and we'll see you guys on the next one.